Any other uh, any other last words, Peter? We got a minute or so here too. Yeah, I just want to announce that um, as as you covered before, I facilitated the opening of a local testing site here at 400 Panago Place at the Panago Ball Fields. That started a week ago, Friday. First day, we had 55 people sign up for appointments for testing at 10 a.m. in the morning. Uh, this is the third uh, day of testing for that site because we're testing Wednesdays and Fridays. Um, you can call in. I believe you guys have the number on the crawler for, uh, for that site. Uh, in addition, I've been working um, to help facilitate a, a location and a site in Montauk. Uh, it looks like the uh, Montauk Fire Department in conjunction uh, with the uh, hospital uh, and some others, a private business owner, uh, willing to uh, allow their property to be the testing site. So we're trying to work through that. That's happening today, just before I got on the call today. It looks like that's coming together. So we hope to have another site up and running, which would be Tuesdays and Thursdays. So that would lead to four days uh, a week of testing in East Hampton. It's very important. The last thing I want to touch on really quick, a critical metric to meet for reopening is contact tracing. We need to have people signed up and trained as contact tracers throughout the region. Uh, we're short on the total number of people. There's a, um, it takes about two hours to get trained, get your name on the list, get trained, uh, whether or not you would be called or not. Ha having those names on a list uh, will count towards our reopening. So go to the town website, ehamptonny.gov, look for contact tracers in the search bar, and uh, that information will be there. Or call 311 on the telephone and ask about contact tracing applications. Well, that's great. And we'll, uh, we'll continue to push that from our end as well, Peter. Um, thank, thank you very much for the information. And um, you and your family have yourself try to grab a day or two to yourselves, huh, this weekend? I, 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 took, uh, I took about 40 minutes, 35, 40 minutes this morning and cut the grass, uh, which is starting to look like, starting to look like a, a meadow restoration. Uh, <laughs> but uh, so I've reclaimed uh, a little area that may go. be somewhat tick-free uh, for the weekend. There you but go. Well, good, so much, good. and I hope everyone stays well, stays safe, follow the protocols, help us get through this. Thank you, Peter Ben Square, everybody, and um, have a good evening. Thank you, Bye. Michael. Be well.